Why does a Chamber of Commerce have a leadership program? When you do a leadership program, you find out about the community, you find out about how it really works, you understand the issues, the resources, the movers, the shakers, the stakeholders in your community. Welcome to Leadership Hollywood. We were actually chartered in 1947. The major part and theme throughout healthcare reform is, is value versus value. Our first day of Leadership Hollywood, we went to Health and Human Services Day. We began our day at Memorial Regional Hospital to explore how Memorial Healthcare System supports the city of Hollywood. We were able to tour the neonatal intensive care unit. We then went on to the Meyerhoff Senior Center and to Lucanus where a play was performed for us, the Broward Outreach Center, and to the Homeless Voice. And it was an interesting perspective for all of us to see. I'm here to give you some insight into what I learned from Public Safety Day. Our men in blue and our firefighters, our beach patrol crews, do day in and day out to protect us and to uh, save us from danger. We start out on the beach. They did an awesome show for us to show us what happened exactly the way it would be if you have a real emergency. We also went into the fire department. We checked out the police department. It's it's really special experience and I suggest you get into leadership and check it out. Really fortunate that we do have some of the best and brightest people. And I'm here to share with you about Art, Education, and Culture Day. First, we started by listening to the superintendent, Dr. Joel Herbst, give us his take on the budget as well as what's going on in Broward County Schools. We also heard from members of the board. We toured the Art and Culture Center of Hollywood. Then we walked across the street to the Art Center at Young Circle Park. It reminded us of the impact that we have in the community by supporting both of these centers and making sure that the arts survive within our community. And finally, we drove over to the Broward Center of Performing Arts, where we took a backstage tour and learned about the ballets, the operas, and the Broadway shows that actually come to Broward County. We enjoyed the day. That's what Hollywood leadership is all about. During city government and economic development day, I got a chance to have a unique perspective in the city government process. I got to play the part of a citizen, which I've always viewed as one of those people who have literally no constraints on what they do and how they interact with the commission. I also really appreciated the opportunity to tour HICO and see the operation that they've built up in Hollywood essentially from scratch and now they're an international company. Let me guess, this is not a school. <laughs> it's kind of a school. We're late Let me turn some lights. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Dave Corey, who is our creative services director. He is responsible in one way or another for uh, nearly every commercial that you hear on 101.5. <laughs> Although I really enjoyed all of my leadership days, the one that stands out most for me is media day. We started off the morning going to the Miami Herald, which was fascinating just to see how the paper was put out and how it was a 24-hour operation. Then we went to Univision and I think it was fascinating just to see the differences in the Latin American cultural television programs and we got to see some celebrities that were walking around and it was quite interesting to watch. We ended the day at the radio stations and I got to see some of my favorite, favorite newscasters and, and DJs and it was wonderful. I could close my eyes and hear their voices. All in all, Media Day was really one of my favorites. We welcome you to the Public Defender's Office. This is our office. This is our main uh, conference room. Your state attorneys, your public defenders, they do a good job and I will defend that um, as long as I'm on the bench. These folks 
So you have your own crime scene investigators that come out of this office? Yes, we do. In fact, if their photos are all listed here. <clears throat> Every day, we know who we work for. We never forget. Judicial Day was very much like a visit to the land of Oz. With the advances in technology, everything is now web-based, including the judge's rulings. So he is, or she is very much like the man behind the curtain. And as for the jails, the visits are all web-based also, which even further keeps the lions, tigers, and bears at bay. What I want to do is I'm just going to go through the kind of the process, how the water comes in and what we do to it to, to treat the process. But this is a new system and everything that was put in. It looks a lot nicer, a lot more modern. Make sure you recycle the bottles when you're through. What we have there here is a 55.5 million gallon per day treatment plant. Uh, we're here today live at the History of Urban and Environmental Day at the City of Hollywood Leadership Class. We've taken the gamut from seeing where our garbage goes to, to where our water comes from, uh, certain problems that we may be encountering now and into the future. And there's a whole wealth of opportunities that the City of Hollywood has already taken advantage of. And it's a perfect time for us to experience what the natural areas here in the state of Florida have to offer and what we need to do to protect them. But here, the idea is to get passengers in and on that ship as soon as possible. So, we are here in the Harbor Master Tower. It's part of the Operations Center. Best day ever! Best day ever! When I bring tour operators and journalists here from all over the world, they fall in love with Hollywood immediately. Anytime I approach the dock, I'll leave a dock. Please have a seat for your safety. It's a no smoking vessel. And today was Travel and Tourism Day. We started the day off by taking a trolley ride down A1A. And then we stopped at a little place, picked up the water taxi, and we took the water taxi down the Intracoastal, which is very beautiful, and we ended up at a dock to go to the Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport. When we got to the airport, we learned a little bit about the history and about some of the things that we're going to be doing in the future. After the International Airport, we went to Port Everglades, and we learned all about the ships that travel in and out. Thank you for giving me an opportunity to talk about a beautiful day. Go leadership. Confucius says, I hear and I forget. I see and I remember. Hey, we got, got food up there. You're welcome there. there. <laughs> SimSoc, also known as a simulated society, is a highly interactive Leadership Hollywood Day which offers Leadership Hollywood members the opportunity to create their own world by incorporating anything and everything from their own communication system to their own political parties. They have to learn how to keep this world going or, sorry, it's gone. This game and day offers no institution, no boundaries, and no rules. And if I were you, I'd watch out for the Red Room. Uh, this is a program that's been going on for 35 years. Uh, I was a member of class of 23. So you'll see some of the fine and outstanding people in the city of Hollywood. We have business people, attorneys, doctors, commissioners, senators, judges, all people who have graduated from this program. And these people are going to be your friends forever, your allies in the community. They will help you advance the mission of your organization, your business agenda, and make your community such a better one for everyone and every business. That's why you need to do a leadership program as well, so you can be better informed and a better business leader in your own community.